Here at home, military bases are on higher alert because of the threats being made by Iran, and that's led to tighter security. Our team coverage continues now with Sam Sweeney outside the Marine Corps base Quantico. Well, another busy day outside of Quantico this morning. Traffic jams up and down the roads surrounding the base. Take a look at the main entrance here. This is the line to get in. Each car must go through a full inspection. Everyone in the car must also show an ID, not just the driver. These are, of course, ramped up inspections because of what is happening in Iran right now. It's not only here at Quantico, but also for Belvoir, Fort Meade. We're seeing it around Walter Reed. The gates are being changed. The hours are being changed and how you get in, which is causing backups in all directions. So if you are traveling in this area or possibly through Montgomery County, around the base, not just going into the base, but around it as well, you could be in in a slowdown. Now, this is the highest state of alert that these bases have been in since 2015. It's called Bravo. We don't know how long it will last, but again, it is going to be at least for the next couple of days, possibly the next several weeks. We'll have to see what happens. Reporting outside of Quantico, I'm Sam Sweeney, ABC 7 News.